I've worked in a lot of different kinds of places, but I never worked in a restaurant what, that was making the food I grew up eating. I went through and I kind of wrote down all my favorite things to eat. And I was like, okay, I can get this, I can get that, I can get this, I can get that, but what can I get? Shoot, I can't get a roti anywhere in Los Angeles. And so for me, and I was like, and that's one of my favorite things, you know, to eat. It's not something I get to eat very often. I basically only had it when we've gone to Barbados. So I was like, man, I think people would really like that. The food's really good. So that's kind of how I came up with Bridgetown. And I knew I could come at it from a authentic place, a place of home and family. So uh, that's where it all started. I want people to taste it and be like, ooh, this tastes like something my grandma would make, or this tastes like something my mom would make. At the same time, I want people to feel the love and feel the fun. We have a lot of fun in our kitchen. You know, it's our, our whole thing is like, we're family, you know, we're professionals, but we have fun. Like that's our ethos. So if you can taste all that in the food, then we win it. I want everyone to be part of the Roti Gang. Like, I, I want people to love our food. I want people to advocate for our food. I want people to evangelize about our food. I'm proud of the product that we put out. I'm proud of everything that we do. And uh, if people appreciate that, it just makes me more proud. I like to play around with Caribbean flavors and, and mix and match. Some of the stuff I do isn't exactly traditional, but it's kind of the way I want to interpret Caribbean food and, and my heritage. So. I would say give it a try. I think everything's delicious, and I think you will too.